Hi engineering janta I am Vaibhav Shukla and today after a lot of messages from your side and getting a lot of responses from your side we decided to build a how to prepare video for the Flipkart grid 7.0 because a lot of students wanted that sir fine I know the complete pattern I know the skeleton of the exam but at least explain me what resources should I refer to how should I prepare myself for the Flipkart because I recently checked the packages that somebody is getting here in Flipkart are somewhere around 24 to 39 LPA this is a huge package if you get shortlisted for the SD1 profile then you might end up in this particular number range fine so this is a big deal so before we dive in deep in today's video we will understand that what exactly is the preparation plan for this Flipkart grid 7.0 I will give you the resources as well and alongside that all you need to do is you need to follow me on this particular Instagram handle Shuklaji speaks here I can help you out directly you can reach out to me directly fine and why this is a very helpful platform a very simple reason for this is that here it's only me who's managing this Instagram so if you DM me it will be me who will be answering you and a lot of students who have DM'd they know I answer them I give audio notes I sometimes record uh, some audio notes while uh, working in the company or doing something fine so all those things happen so you can go ahead follow me at this handle if you want direct help and we'll go ahead and we'll understand about the rounds first because I have told you this I know but I'll skim through it so it has basically four rounds. the first one is screening round the second one is coding challenge third one is case study based code and fourth one is national finals in this coding challenge you'll be solving three coding problems in 90 minutes fine so here there will be three different coding problems first one would be medium second one would be from medium to moderately hard fine and the third one will be proper hard problem fine so these three problems would appear in the second stage here you will be shortlisted based upon your academic performance fine based upon your academic performance alongside that what else your accolades your awards things like that fine so all that would matter in the first round and henceforth things will become important I'll tell you we'll go further so for the first round as I told you the registered candidates will undergo a screening process where academic performance and consistency so how consistently you have been good in academics for example you scored 60% in 10th you scored 85% in 12th and in degree you scored 88% so you have been on a vertical curve of learning you have been a vertical curve of uh, excellence or a better academic performance right but if you are somebody who scored 10 CGPA in 10 and then in class 12th you managed to score somewhere around 74% and in degree you manage to score around 60-62% then you are on a declining curve and henceforth your chances are bleak that's why I am saying that consistency would also matter but to all those people who have been good academic performers to all those people who have done some good projects they have good resume they have boosted their resume well they have practiced a lot of things they can easily be considered here and your achievements non-academic achievements other accolades for example be it sports be it debating be it poetry be it other competitions anything be it hackathons everything matters here therefore resume fixing is super essential here so I would rather change this line into a straighter one so here resume fixing is super essential and you need to work a lot on resume now how do you do that all you need to do is something like this you can find on prepinstaprime.com you can hop onto your favorite OTT there you use that particular course to actually enhance your resume along with that from prepinstaprime only get these project ideas from end to end they are built there you go ahead watch those videos and that would help you out fine how to reach prime I will tell you in a while now second is the coding challenge and it is the most important round because this decides whether you are getting the call for the interview or not in approximately 50 to 60 percent manner if you are good here if you have done well in the coding challenge 50 to 60 percent chances are there that you will be called for the interview for any winter internship or any summer internship or any SD1 full-time profile now 
you have basics of working with numbers, you have looping, functions, recursions, number series, coordinate geometry, strings, mathematical logics, many topics like this. So these are basic topics. This is for the first medium question, fine. Now if you're somebody who wants to solve all three questions and if you want to go ahead in the coding challenge, you should be solving all three questions, fine. Best case possible. What is the best case here? All three questions, fine. all test cases is it clear all three questions all the test cases if you've done this 100 percent you're going forward fine if you have solved two questions this is first scenario this is second scenario two questions all test cases one question partial test cases and these two solutions are optimized fine if they are optimized then in that case again you have chances of qualification but other than this there is no chance of qualification now how do you do this very simple thing is start from the basic coding fine from the very basics so all you need to do is go ahead either you can enroll into any company's course any company be it i have written in forces here so that you can get an idea that what's the basic hang of it fine basic hang to start the basic coding the basic service level based coding i'm not saying it would come it would clear your basics fine it would give you a foundation once you're done with this then you can go ahead and you can practice some advanced topics fine also there is a list called 150 not out I have explained a lot about this list, fine. I have enough times stressed a lot upon it. So I'll open the things up here for you. See, so let's go ahead. Let's search out 150 not out. All you need to do is search this 150 not out. This list has complete solution and this is free of cost. These are only 150 questions. If you have done this, I always say this, you can clear any product based company, any service based company, anything that you believe is under the sun in the domain of DSA, you can clear with this list, fine. However, this list can be done by the people who have a basic foundation in the DSA, fine. How do you build that? As I told you, prep Insta Prime, you come here, either you hop on to this, start learning from languages or you can start from the basic coding itself, intermediate coding and then DSA in various languages. Fine. So you can do that for the coding challenge portion and the, that would help you out. Also the competitive coding portion would help you here. Fine, wait, I'll show you. So if I'm not wrong, competitive coding is there itself only, no? This is competitive coding course. Everything is available here and all of this is under one single subscription. I'll come to that, 200 plus courses are there and all you need to do is click on this get prime fine and in this get prime in the filling of this coupon code you need to put shukla 10 fine if you want maximum discount you put shukla 10 and that would help you out so if i proceed with that shukla 10 coupon code i'll find out some discount here so this can also help you out and that would give you some discount there, fine. So this is one thing that you can do. Did it show you the discount or I guess it did not. So I'll fill this up here, fine. So Shukla 10, all you need to do is fill this Shukla 10 and you click here and you'll have this discount immediately. But if you want extra discount, stay till the end, I'll tell you there's one more way to avail extra discount but i'll come back here the point is you need to prepare all these topics which are the advanced level topics i've given you the resources 150 not out is one resource where you can practice a lot of things it is a free of cost list however you need to have a strong solid base in dsa to go ahead with that list now when i go further round three is case study based code in this particular round you need to have a solid grip on a few things. For example, 
your industry skills fine trending industry skills what are those for example gen ai fine nowadays a lot of solutions can be made using gen ai fine what else data science fine what else ai engineers fine what else ai engineering courses basically fine or ai engineering modules so these are in trend fine what else is in trend evergreen thing full stack and you will need this because you are solving problems for e-commerce so i would suggest you what you can do is to practice this case study based code because here you will get the shortlisted people from that coding challenge from round two will receive a business problem and using that particular statement of flipkart they have to solve that problem using a tech uh, particular technology or a particular tech based domain they have to solve that and this will require you to build a tool or a system basically you will be building an enterprise grade project where you would propose the solution and will share the code for the same the solution code that you have written to solve a particular problem that has been shared with you for that particular thing you will need to build some good projects you will need to have a good hands on experience in the skills that i am mentioning you here so first focus on learning skills your preparation should be focused on learning skills like data science i have mentioned here this you can find on prep insta prime again structured course absolutely from very basic to the very last you will build multiple projects there alongside that you can build such projects big basket cart prediction such projects are e-commerce based fine and these will actually give you an experience that what challenges does e-commerce industry face i'll show you see all these are available on prime if i go further see all these are av available netflix movie recommendation is available amazon user segmentation is available now flipkart is somewhere here so you should go ahead and build this project so that you understand a few things about user segmentation about how e-commerce segments user fine you should go ahead you should do some data analysis projects but most importantly for web development for crm understanding these two are there for any kind of prediction for the e-commerce big basket card prediction project is there on prime you can go ahead you can build these projects out these will help you out for the round three fine once round three is done top 48 students or basically top 12 teams would be found basically top 48 students will be there fine and these top 48 students would be divided into 12 teams out of these 12 teams six winners would be announced where two would share the first prize two would share the second prize and two teams would share the third prize fine so here the detailed brief would be given to you you'll have to show the final working prototype in a live demo for that as well you need to build a lot of projects as i told you see i have mentioned here this project clone music player i have mentioned facebook ads optimization i have mentioned a lot of projects here the reason is because in this competition building much more projects being in sync with a lot of technology upcoming technologies is actually going to help you so you should go ahead and focus on that particular portion and that's pretty much about the preparation plan of flipkart grid 7.0 now if you're somebody who's looking for how to register or how to enroll in prep insta prime all you need to do is either ping me directly in instagram fine or you can go ahead on the website use this coupon code shukla10 and this would give you the discount however to all those students who are actually good who are actually working hard for all of them you can dm me on instagram this is my handle at the rate shuklaji speaks fine this is my handle you dm me here and only one thing you have to write challenge fine you write that out and i would pose a challenge to you whatever challenge i would give you if you solve that correctly fine within an hour of giving that particular challenge if you solve that correctly you will receive some extra coupon code fine from my end which would provide you more discount than this particular coupon code fine so that would be from my side as a teacher i can help you out there and the reason that i am telling you to go ahead and explore this is because you have 200 plus courses in one single subscription so this beats 
the idea of altogether having 50 different courses for 50 different skills fine nothing to worry about you can go ahead you can watch all these 200 plus courses under one single subscription and that's why i'm saying this is the favorite ott for upskilling and you should follow us on all the social media handles so that you never miss any hiring update from our side now whatever information i'm giving you go ahead spread it out as far as you can keep doing good for others without any expectation i always keep on saying this for others keep doing good good will come back to you in multiplied forms have a wonderful day ahead bye bye